What's going on people of the vlog? Welcome to a new one. Um, what's the date today? She always start a vlog with the date. It's the 29th of December. Shit, there's actually a, a car show today. Well, I'm broke as hell. So, never went to a car show. But let me take you through the plans for today. So, the rock is over here. Um, Today we're planning on doing, uh, well I'm planning on doing uh, the Witch of Self, a DIY wheel alignment. Um, as you see, I got, uh, got EJ's wheels on over here. So the bags are not on. Currently I have my dad's, him and I have been having such a crap holiday. Um, my original wheels that came with the back of the TSWs, all of the tires popped, so um, I had to make a plan, so I hustled, I, I don't know, just got money at least to buy a set of tires, so this is the back, the one is at the back of the back, I had issues with this wheel though. The, the guys I took took to mount the tires, like no one wanted to help me because there were stretch tires, no one in the area at least. I found one that was willing to help, but they tore my one tire, like on the bead of the tire, so it wasn't that bad. Well, it, it, I think it is bad because um, EJ referred me actually to this one guy that he helped him mount his tires on his other wheels, his new wheels. So he, there was one guy that at the wheel place not too far from here, he got it right, so told me to go to him. So I went to him and then luckily managed to mount the tires because the previous guys I took it to, they couldn't mount the tires, they, they struggled. So. The only problem they had with this tire was because of the tear on the bead. It was leaking it. They struggled to, like, how can I say, make the tire stretch and uh, make it seal so air doesn't leak. But it, for now it seems to be fine. I did this about two days ago. I mounted this tire, the back tires, and it seems to be fine. Well, just standing. We'll see when I put it on the car, I guess. And then I'm probably gonna um, set the right height because before I do the, obviously do the wheel alignment, I'm gonna have to set the right height. Um, so I have to do that. And then I wanna see how low this car can go. I haven't tested it out with the, the new coilovers. So I also want to do that and then like I'm hoping I can do a, a photo shoot or at least do cinematic shots of of the Bucky slammed out on the new wheels. I do plan to go like negative camera with the back wheels but let's first see if that wheel can actually hold air with the weight of the Bucky. So if it does then I will. This Bucky is fairly simple to to um, get camber done on it so I'm not gonna drive it drive it daily like that I don't wanna mess up the tires so I'll dri I drive it at, on a square setup just no camber nothing and then just before I show I'll get in the I uh, will use washers to get some some camber and I need probably a spacer or, or two or make spaces which I'm broke. I don't know. But yeah, I'm speaking too much. Let me get started. As you can see, space is a bit limited because of all this junk that's in here. But yeah, let me get started. 
I'm gonna start by um, removing the back wheels, putting the EJ's wheels on, and then we can go from there because I need to first set the right height to my liking and then do my alignment, if that makes sense. Yeah, let me get crack a lack in. Okay, wheel is on. Yo, guys, it's not easy to work in this garage. There's very limited space. Not so far so good, it seems like the tire is still holding on fine. It's not getting flat. Yeah, no, it seems to be fine. Maybe I must just take some soap water. Spray on it and see if anything happens, but it seems to be okay. So I'm not gonna record me changing the other side. I must just do the next side and then you see it will be fine. Let me see if I'm good at the right height. It seems to be fine, maybe I won't I won't touch a thing, I'm not completely sure. Okay. And yeah, this wheel spoke pretty nice. Probably can't see that because of the bad light in the garage. So maybe it's just like I would like to say a 9mm spacer. But sometimes a 9mm spacer you need to get longer wheel nuts. And sometimes the speaker the ring doesn't line up. So we'll see. We'll see what I do. What's that? Oh, is that you? <laughs> oh yes, most daily love society. Please say what's up, baby. I'm not ugly. Um, so she might give me a hand. Maybe she will just make the pipes. We're gonna have flavor and go. Make a pie, baby. We're gonna make us a pie. Maybe. She says maybe. Okay, let me start with the next wheel. Get that sorted. And then I can maybe adjust the height if needs be. Okay, people of the vlog. I just got done putting on the other wheel. It took a little bit. Um, I think I'm gonna take the car for a test drive to check if that tire holds air, the one that tore. So please, Guys, pray for me. Pray. I know it's gonna be late when you see this video, but pray now that the next clip you see, the tire is still fine. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go take it for a test drive quickly. Yo, people of the vlog, I decided now. Shit, I'm gonna go to the garage to go and full tire pressure, make sure everything is fine. Um, so far, so good seems okay yeah let me just because I felt the tire with the tape feels a bit softer than the other tire so yeah I'm just gonna go in full tire pressure this was so hey bad news guys hey sorry man I'm not used to this driving and vlogging thing maybe I need that other stick extensions but they call it gorilla pods or something like that I need one of those so bad news is that I is still leaking so I tried what do you call a tire jack the guys were helping me out at the garage yeah we felt uh, deflated the tire um, we put in the tire jack seal and thingy so hey, I'm hoping it will help the guy said I must drive so you can circulate and go towards the leaks so it seems like I'm gonna have to spend money again the thing I'm thinking is take it to the wheel place maybe tomorrow and have that guy take the one tire from the back that is torn and put it on one of the wheels in front 
because the wheels in front are 7J and the wheels at the back are 7.5 so maybe yeah maybe it will help maybe it will be better that way so ish, hopefully you will help me because ish, everyone runs away here in Centurion I, if you guys don't know I stay in Centurion so most of the guys over here they don't want to work with stretch tires they refuse they turn me away the one day and it just so happens on that day my tires popped my old tires so I was desperate to get tires fitted and they didn't want to help me they turned me away went here went there and yeah when my tires popped on my way back home so yeah it's, it's a stress sometimes this fucking 16540 tire is just a problem but I'm hoping maybe this will help. We'll see. Anyways, get you up and I'm on. Hey guys, I'm sure you can hear that. And you can see the bubbles. This tire is leaking. Uh, it's, it's going silent. Fuck. So leaking. Yeah, so I don't know if what I'm doing today is going to be pointless. Yes, man. Like, if everything can go bad, it's happened to me, guys. Like, you don't understand. I've spent so much money just to get those tires on. It's just a headache. Yeah, man. Like, please like this video. Show some love, hopefully. I can use YouTube money to buy a new tire. Yo, how's it sounding worse? <sighs> hey guys, I'm not sure what to do anymore. Mm. Okay, let me go on. If the tire gets flat, the tire gets flat. I'll just put another wheel on. The vlog must continue. Yeah, let me re pull the back, uh, the party back in the garage and keep it moving. Okay, so it seems like if where the leak is, uh, ah, fuck, I don't know if you guys can see that. But if the leak is over here on the side wall, let's just open this door to try and get more light. Okay, so if the leak is here, this here where the lip and the side wall of that iron meet, it's leaking. So it seems like if the leak, if I park on the the wheel where the leak is make the leak be at the bottom it seems to hold air so I'm gonna leave it like that what I plan to do is hopefully tomorrow go in swap those two tires hopefully this tire doesn't leak yeah man uh, but I think I should start with this alignment thing otherwise I'm gonna be busy the whole day yeah man, let me get crack like it. Let me just show you guys quickly how this is gonna work. So as you see, I have a, a vice grip here, I just locked it. I loosened this two bolts here and as you can see now, can maneuver the hub assembly. So then I'm gonna put the wheel back on. I have two packets. I'm gonna put that on top of each other. And I'm gonna take, this is used oil. I'm gonna just put used oil in the middle. Uh, where is that pipe? I might have to cut. Mother, mother asked. Huh? Mother asked if we want those two sliders. The what? Those what? Two sliders. Sliders? Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Okay. 
then I'm gonna take this pipe, I'm probably gonna cut it just place it against the wheel and then use my girlfriend's lovely phone use the measuring app to get it to zero but yeah let me let me get working then I'll show you what I'm gonna do okay so people of the vlog just gonna take a break even if I even though I didn't do anything but yeah the wheel is back on check it out the shopping packets are underneath it just gonna smoke a pipe at bay enjoy some ciders thanks to thanks to Mama Daily Low. <laughs> my mother worked us up with ciders yeah but yeah I'm just gonna take a break wait what's the time now? am I wasting time? don't even lie ah but it's short it's short <laughs> anyways yeah as long as I can at least drop the car at sunset and that tire doesn't leak then yeah, I think today is still alright. Okay, people have vlog. So, as you see, you put a pole next to it. So, I pretty much got it mm. as close to zero as possible. It works on the side. Is it on zero? Mm -hmm. So, you just want to get the measuring app, put it on this thingy and get it close to zero as possible. And then you don't wanna make like the wheel move. So what I did is lay underneath the car, tighten the one bolt, then I'm gonna jack it up and then tighten both bolts securely. And hopefully this thing is aligned. Yeah. Oh, I say pick you up. Thanks for the help. It was daily low. Okay, people of the vlog, the DIY wheel alignment was just a fail. Like, it's not enough space in this garage, and I think I need help, like, by someone else. Um, because you literally, someone is gonna have to hold the wheel straight for, for you, and you're gonna have to go underneath the car and tighten the ball so it doesn't move so i i tried thames and tried helping me tried pulling the wheel and holding it in position but it's just too hard to pull it like i felt even when i pulled it it was really it was like a real struggle so i'm gonna put it back how it was i'm gonna probably have to pay for wheel alignment once i have money so yeah guys please <laughs> yeah like like this video even though it's boring if it's boring tell your friends about our our channel yeah man but thanks for all the love and support this year has been a, amazing our channel grew a lot like i think if i can think from the start just before first we were on 600 just just before 600 like maybe 590 or something like that why are you smiling at me like it? And now, now we're on 2,600, so that's a big jump. Yay, man, I'm vlogging. <laughs> Why are you being weird? <laughs> yeah, so, but thank you, Miss Daily Low, for the help. Hey, man, I'm vlogging. What are you doing? What, what, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> ah man <laughs> okay let me get to work <laughs> I'm gonna put it back to normal eyeball it if this this woman gives me a chance <laughs> okay people of the vlog I'm gonna call it today um so I'm not gonna do the I'm gonna take the tires tomorrow to get swapped and then I'll drop the bucky and do a photo shoot for you guys so this vlog will continue tomorrow. Uh, what's up people of the vlog? It's the next day. Yeah, so it's later in the day, it's about three o'clock. So they haven't vlogged this yet. We're on a mission now. 
to get our tickets for tomorrow because tomorrow is New Year's Eve so if you're watching this Happy New Year's and Merry Christmas guys I hope you guys enjoying the festive season that's our missions now then I need to wash this bucket because we're gonna do a photo shoot and a video shoot later on today so yeah man keep vlog it's gonna be a good one how the bucket looks with, with the momos and finally get to see how Love the back to go with the blue line charms. Yeah man, keep it locked. I'm excited. I'm excited. What's on going on people of the vlog? Uh shit. We it's been like an hour or two. I'm back home. Um I'm have to, I'm in a rush now, I'm gonna wash the back quickly. And then I'm gonna beat Riley and EJ at one of our old spots. We did a video shoot of EJ's car like a while back, like maybe a year ago. So we're going back to that spot. Yeah, so let me watch this back quickly. Hey, people of the vlog, all clean. Got three of the caps on. Uh, yeah. One I can't get on because I think that one is on. Because I think EJ uh, used the glue gun to get it on because it looks like the screw thing is yes yeah, broken. Uh, got my daily low joining me. Gonna get to the spot. Then yeah, Iri and and Riley will get me there. Alright, people of the vlog. I'm here at the location. Uh, yeah, I need to start checking out. But this is one of the streets that we shot in um, EJ's video like a year back. Yeah man, it's nice palm trees, yeah. Yeah, the rich people's plots, yeah. What's going on people of the vlog? Yo, it's been a while since you, you seen your man Eerie on the channel. Yeah, but this is his new look, new wheels. Yeah, forgot to tell you guys. And then this is how the back you look. Just need some bags. He's driving that thing most rough. <laughs> yeah. It's poking, it's hella poking, yeah. Maybe just a spacer. Maybe one washer will do it some good. Yeah. Okay, let me get this thing on the gimbal and start shooting. Oh, okay, here's your boy, Riley. So what's up to the people of the vlog, man? No way, people of the Tell them what you've been drinking, doing the whole holiday. It's been a minute. <laughs> yeah, it's first off. Just been drinking. Every day. <laughs> it's amazing. Okay. 